after we talked a lot in the last session, this session, very good news, no talking at all. Therefore, you can all just uh, stand up wherever you are and start to warm up yourself. Uh, if you have the possibility to run around, then yeah, important is just start moving. Continue, move, relax the shoulders, relax the arms, keep moving, keep moving. So how do you know that, uh, that you're making it correct? Well, you should feel like slowly getting warm. Relax the shoulders until the fingers, so let everything loose. There is no structure in that one. Just keep moving. Make yourself warm. Three, four more minutes. Keep moving, don't stop. At the same time, regulate your breath so you're not getting out of breath too quickly. So don't make your warm-up session already too intensive that you are getting out of breath. Learn to regulate your breathing. This is the fourth month of the, of the course, so that means, meanwhile, you should have been able to, to learn and understand what it means to regulate the breath. Through the nose, deep inhalation, and then slowly exhale. Yeah, keep moving, don't stop. Okay, then now just, uh, just pay attention. I'm going to give you now a very short routine that you can just start following along with me. Number one is yeah, put, inter intertwine the fingers and rotate. Yeah. Look, the elbows, the elbows are closed, so not out like this. Elbows are closed. And here, rotate, yeah? See, it's like a, it's like the cranks of a bicycle rotate to the front. Elbows are close. And then switch directions. Other side, rotate backwards. If you look from the side, look, it's here. Look, elbows are close. Uh, not like this. Uh, not like this. Keep the hands where they are. Just rotate. Okay, switch direction one more time. Then next, just the wrist, rotate inwards.
and outside. Relax the shoulders. Don't tense up the chest. Inhale deeply, exhale deeply. Then next, elbows. Yeah, concentrate. Where are your elbows? Don't move the shoulders. Now look. Now if you watch me, you see my 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 upper arms are actually not moving. It's just from the elbow joint. From the elbow joint, you're moving. You're circling outwards from the elbow joint. Yeah, other direction. Then arms, just let them hang, yeah. shoulders. Uh, let the arms hang. So that means also here, pay attention when you're rotating backwards, that you are not lifting, that you are not lifting this elbow. Yeah. So not here and then pull up the arm, you see then the elbow is tense again, yeah, let the arm hang. Next we go to the head. The head, just watch down. Up. Down. Up. One. Two. One. Two. One. Two. One. Two. One, two. Continue. Continue this movement and here what are you paying attention on that you are not um, you're not bending the chest. So it's the top part of the spine. Just look down, look up. If you like to integrate your breath into this movement, for example, every time the head goes down. You can inhale, up, exhale, in, out, in, out, in, out. Okay. Next movement of the head, keeping the spine straight, just look to the left, so turn to the left, turn to the right. Look to the left and back to the right. Turn to the left and back to the right. In this exercise now, shoulders, upper torso doesn't move, so it's really just the head and other direction. Inhale to the left and exhale to the right. Inhale to the left, exhale to the right. Inhale left, exhale right. One more time, inhale left, exhale right. Now look back to the front, 
Now with the head, we start looking to the right. Then you bend down half a circle all the way to the left side, half a circle on the right. So it's a full circle, a full circle with the head slowly, slowly, and the half circle in the front. Inhale the circle. Um, the circle when the head is behind your body is exhale. Let's go together a few times. So inhale. Exhale. In. Out. In. Out. In. Out. And other direction. Inhale. Out. In. In, out, and in, out. Then small fingers pointing towards the chest. Yeah, like this. Small fingers touching the chest. Shoulder relax. And now you go up on the inhalation, lift the elbows. Fingers still touch the chest. Yeah, inhale. Still in, in, in. Still touch. Open, open the chest. Then exhale, bring them down back to the first position. So we are working in circles. Inhale. Exhale. In. Out. Inhale. Exhale. Yeah. Inhale. Exhale. Uh, open the chest, open up, stretch the chest open. Continue, inhalation and when the arms are sinking down, it's exhalation. Two more times, inhale, exhale. And one more time. Inhale and exhale. Now we go to the spine. Yeah, we go to the spine from here. To yeah, very soft. When you are turning to the left side, the right heel is up. When you turn to the right side, the left heel is up. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Then cross arms open. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then arms 
let them hang and yeah, bend to the front bend to the front the tailbone yeah your butt so right now the butt is out so no no butt out here this one is take it in so make this one here long and round long and round arms shoulders relax then the chin you yeah, also now yeah you're gonna take the chin in the head behind the head stay in that position stay in this position so now important listen so the, ch the, the your chin you must take it very close to the chest and the stretching of the spine comes because you are relaxing more so you are not pushing anything the the lengthening of the back part of your body the lengthening of your spine it comes because you are relaxing so that means you stay in that position and you relax into this position. Don't bend down too much. Don't bend down, yeah? So your head is actually uh, still above, almost above your solar plexus. The head is above the solar plexus. Don't take it down too much. Yeah, your back is round. The back is round, so. If you are making it correctly, you can actually feel that on your back there are some parts which are maybe starting to burn or maybe it's a little bit something like an uncomfortable pain. And this is how you know, okay, you need to practice that one more. So this is in order to relax the back side of the body. Now just drop the arms to the front slowly let the hands sink down and raise up the body back to the center and raise back to the center this time open the palms to the side look up Now you're looking, you're looking up to the sky. Sometimes this posture is also called opening the heart to the heaven. So imagine you are opening your heart towards the heaven. And again here, the stretch of the chest, the stretch of the front side of the body, it comes because you are letting go of tension. You are not adding any tension. So that means if you are relaxing into this posture, you will feel that the front side of the chest from the left arm, from the fingers of the left arm, yeah, all the way crossing the chest to the right arm, there you have a connection point. There you have a connection line. At the same time now, um, pay attention to your neck. So don't look too much up that you are blocking the neck. Don't block the neck. Okay, good. Return back to the center. Then feet stand a little bit more wide so that you can move. And now from here. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Other direction. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Good. 
hands on your waist. Rotate. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Other direction. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, good. Now, need to practice a little bit your balance. We are paying attention now to here. Yeah, the the joint from the leg where it hits uh, the body. Yeah, from here. So turn out one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight. Other side. Yeah, use your hands. Use your hands to balance yourself. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. Feet together. Both palms. Towards the knee, then leg straight and squat down. Straight down. Straight down. Straight. Straight and down. Okay, good. Knees open. Rotate one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Other direction. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, then stand on the left foot, right ankle, rotate one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Other direction, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Switch leg. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Other direction, one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Good. So this was now a very short, a very short routine. So and you don't need to remember uh, the exercises because uh, the only thing I did was I go from the smallest joints that I have until I have uh, just worked all the joints. Which means we started with the fingers. We start with the fingers and the wrist 
uh, fingers, wrist, then came the elbow, afterwards came the shoulders, then back to the center we go top, comes the head, then we are at the spine, then you use the spine left, right, front, back, then comes the hip, both directions, then comes the knees, and then comes the ankles. Yeah. So the point is, how do you remember? You don't remember, you just work all the joints that you have. Okay, good. Now, um, month number four, I think, yeah, it's time to build up also some type of strength to get back some strength into the body. And that means how do we do it? Uh, we do all the stuff that we normally don't do on an average day, which is like, yeah, very easy. We don't make a lot of push-ups. Some of you, if you want to make, you can, but the rest just stand. Just stand in this position, look. You can go on the fist or you can go on the palm, doesn't matter. Yes, stand. Okay, the first round, we stay like this. Uh, one minute. Starting from now. Keep the tension. Uh, don't let your butt hang down. Keep the structure properly. 30 seconds. Fifteen seconds. Okay, and uh, who needs a break right now, you can take a one minute break and the rest just keep standing. Whoever took a break, you still have 30 seconds. And everyone who is like still standing you don't want to waste energy which means you only keep the tension inside of the structure that's necessary to keep the posture all the rest you release okay five seconds for the other ones to join in again and again one minute go don't hold the breath Keep moving, uh, keep breathing. Thirty seconds. Fifteen seconds. And who needs a break? Take one minute break or thirty seconds break and then just join in whenever you feel ready again and the rest just keep standing.
30 seconds. And the last minute. Now don't give up. Keep going. One more minute to go. Thirty seconds. Fifteen. And ten. Nine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and then now ten push ups. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So, okay. Uh, yeah, well done. So it was five minutes for the one who started from the beginning and made it till the end. Five minutes is not so bad. It's a good, it's a good beginning. Yeah, but the point is uh, you don't need to move to challenge yourself. So just standing around and doing nothing also is very challenging from time to time. All right. Then now the body should be warm. The blood should be in the arms. So that means the arms are heavy, your system is circulating, maybe you're sweating, which is also a good sign. And now we just slowly go together three times, uh, walk through the form that we started in the last three sessions. And I go it a little bit super slow so that you can uh, follow along. We do it three times together and then afterwards we continue with the next movement.